Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how you can optimize your SVG icon or optimize the SVG markup. So let's get started. This is the icon that I'm going to be optimizing today. The first thing I'm going to do is drag and drop this icon onto my browser. And then I'm going to go and weave the page source. So this is the source code for your SVG icon, as you can see. And the next thing you want is this online tool. I've been using this online tool for a very long time and it's very effective. And I will share this link with you in the description. So if I go back to my SVG markup, I want to select the whole markup and copy it and then go back to my online tool and then paste it in here so once you start pasting after you paste your markup in here it will show you your SVG icon and just so you know this is already been optimized so there's uh, there's couple of default settings that has been applied so that's why it's already been optimized you can see your original code too in here so this was my original svg code which i had before optimizing it and this is how it looks after it is optimized and there are a lot of settings in here so you can play around with some of the settings in he here and see how it works for your svg and uh, make sure that some of the settings does not break your svg icon things like this if i reduce this value for zero you can see these SVG lines changing so make sure your settings doesn't break your SVG icon or how it looks so now that I'm done with optimizing I'm gonna click here and copy my new optimized markup and then I'm gonna go here to my original SVG icon right click on it and you can open in any editor you want for now i'm just gonna open it on notepad and i'm going to select what we have already and delete it and then paste the new code in here and save it so if i go back to my browser and refresh the svg as you can see the svg message looks the same but it's optimized and if i go to my source code which i had it open earlier and if i refresh you will see the new optimized markup this one so this is how you can actually optimize the svg and i hope this helped guys thanks for watching have a nice day